And this is how Liverpool start the game. The highly rated Brazilian Alisson begins between the posts. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Dejan Lovren in central defence. Sadio Mane starts with Mohamed Salah out wide. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Well, Liverpool, the record winners of the European Cup of Champions League amongst English sides. And it's always something magical when they take part in this competition. Well, it's such rich history at this football club. Right through the players, the staff, but even more so with the spectators. They expect Liverpool to go deep in this competition. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Looks as though they're going with the belt and braces approach. Yeah, 5-3-2 or 3-5-2. The midfield will be flooded when they've got the ball. Defensively, those fullbacks will be asked to supply support to their three centre-backs. But it does enable you to play two strikers up front. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? And it is the opening goal of the contest. Well, it was always going to be a tight game, but now all of a sudden, one team ahead. Things have got to change on both sides. Well, it's good build-up, and there's one player standing in front of the goal, and it falls to him, and he's not going to miss from there. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. of players waiting in the middle Mane Fabinho Origi will he find the net and it's in for Liverpool is there a way back for the opposition now Well, as we can see, if a striker is free in the box and the great ones just stand still, they know chances will come in that position and he wasn't disappointed. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Robertson. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Well, that's one for them to pursue. The goals keep going in for them. I don't think they're going to throw this away now. Absolutely omnipotent. Let's have another look at this. He wasn't expecting the ball, but when it comes to him, he chooses early to volley it. What a finish. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Origi, he's gone for power, Lee, but it's wide. Well, no real direction, but the power was there, and you're right, it's just gone past the post. So the corner played into the box. Oh, you can see he was feeling the pressure, but gave it a go anyway. Not close, though. Well, it was definitely worth the chance, just got the technique a little bit off. how to do it inside your own penalty area and teammates to play it to Firmino well it's a procession of goals and surely there's no way they can let this slip now absolutely dominant Well, let's see that one again. It's all about the contact, does everything right. He's not bothered where the goal is. He knows where it is. He gets a beautiful strike on it. A chance to revisit the goal. Well, he took care of it defensively, firing it in. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. 
Well, let's see that again. Oh, it's so sweetly hit. Look at his technique. Absolutely brilliant. He's got the power, he's got the accuracy, and now he's got himself a goal. There goes the full-time whistle, and Liverpool fans won't mind this at all. Liverpool with three points from their first game of this Champions League campaign. Well, it's everything you want from the start of match one. Good, strong start. That result will give everybody confidence, especially the players. Well done. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well, looked really sharp constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real handful.